The management of Dangote Industries Limited says it owns Obajana Cement Plant 100% and its acquisition in 2002 followed due process. The company said this in the statements issued by Anthony Chiajina, Group Head Branding and Communications, titled Obajana Cement Plant, Separating Facts from Fiction. The statement noted that in 1992, the Kogi government incorporated Obajana Cement PLC as a public limited liability company, but instead that the Kogi government had no equity interest in Obajana Cement PLC. It also stated that the company had been paying relevant taxes, levies and charges to the government since it started production in 2007. According to Dangote, the Obajana plant was built and acquired solely by Dangote Industries Limited in 2003 well after it had acquired the shares in Obajana Cement Company in 2002, following the legal binding agreements it entered into with the Kogi government. The statement further noted that the limestone and other minerals used by the Obajana Cement Plant belong to the federal government, which has the authority to grant licenses to extract and mine the resources. The company said that the government had no minerals and assets to give. It only invited the DIL to come into the state and invest in a manner that will create employment, develop the state and earn its taxes. According to the statement, since the inception of Alaji Yahaya Bello's administration in 2016, and regardless that government is a continuum, the company has had a series of inquiries about the ownership structure of the Dangote Cement PLC as it relates to the alleged interest of KSG. The company stated that in 2017, it was invited by the Judicial Commission of Inquiry and made its submission to the Commission with relevant documents to support its position, but they are yet to receive a feedback from the Judicial Commission of Inquiry. The company said the disruption of operation at the plant has caused loss of revenue to the company, its customers, the federal and state governments.